his strike so much and Mikoski has to worry about a lot of things coming. He doesn't want to charge in, get hit with some crazy spinning elbow off the kick. He's got to be respectful, his ability to hit everywhere. Not a lot of guys can do that. But not a lot of guys can do that either. From the that single is a leg, beautiful takedown. Waist cinch takedown. That was slick. Again, side control held by Mikoski. These are two phenomenal fighters. They're fast, they're unorthodox, they're skillful, they're flexible. And now, the new Bellator World Bantamweight Champion, Zach Fonsai Markovsky. Seven weighing in at 135 pounds. The season five tournament champion as a professional brings 13 victories, two defeats. From Rio de Janeiro, Brazil, introducing the duo, Eduardo Dantas. At five foot four, weighing in at 134 and one half pounds. Tonight, in his first title defense, he enters the cage with 14 professional victories, just two defeats. And walked right him a little now, bit towards the, the center of the cage, so we can't uh, cage walk out. Now going for the head and arm choke. Head and arm choke gets in from Eduardo Dantes. Yeah, that's a Novignol specialty. Shaolin, so good at this choke, you know he passed it on to Eduardo Dantes. That is very That's cool. it! And that is a out. technical submission! Markovsky is out cold, and Eduardo Dantes is the new Bellator Bantamweight World Champion! Stepped over, this is how you do a side choke, an arm triangle choke. Zach Markovsky did the correct escape, trying to get space, but look at that pressure, no chance. The new Bellator Bantamweight World Champion, Dudu Eduardo Dantas. A very fired up Joe Warren making his way towards the Bellator cage, but then Jimmy, when is Joe Warren not fired up? Yeah, he's fired up on the toilet. I mean, every <laughs> second of every day, he's telling himself how bad he is. You cannot like his attitude, you cannot like the way he carries himself, but being a hard man is being able to take a good beating, then get back up again and carry on fighting. That's how he has won in the Bellator cage. Joe. Okay, the rules protect yourself at all times, obey my commands at all times. If you want to touch gloves, touch them now, best of luck to both of you. It's Dantas coming oh, forward. Oh, big up your job! That's it! You can finish and he does! Okay. He's still okay. going back to the single leg. Was that from Eduardo Dantes? And there's the tap, and there's the successful title defense. Highlight real submission by the champ, Eduardo Dantes. Final round resumes of this fight for Bellator's bantamweight world title. Joe Warren versus Eduardo Dantes. Regardless of who you think is winning this fight or who you think will win this fight, a lot of people thought Joe Warren was just a clown and didn't deserve to be here. He has shown that he is an elite bantamweight. I believe he has really shown that tonight. And Jimmy Warren, as he did in that last sequence, showing the willingness to eat the Dauntless knee to get that, the position for the takedown from the way cinch. And this crowd, every time he does anything, they erupt for him. All for the winner by unanimous decision. And now, a two-time two-weight class world champion, the new Bellator Bantamweight World Champion, For a leg lock, he's in knee bar position. He's getting Joe's weight off that leg. Warren trying to stack Galvo. Oh, he's got it! And that, is deep. that is tight! Look at the torque! Look at the face of Joe Warren! The he screams! That's it! That is it! That is a verbal submission on the screen! And we have a new champion! It is Marcos Galvo! Warren is protesting, but he screamed. You scream, that's it. That is a verbal submission. We have a new champion. The new Bellator Bantamweight World Champion, the Brazil, Marcos Lolo 
Protect yourself at all times, obey my commands at all times. Fight hard, but fight clean. If you want to touch gloves, touch them again. Good luck to both of you. Not to start to Roy Jones in a little bit, and these are getting through. The right eye is close. It is. It's swelling badly. We are getting near desperation time for the world champion. Get respect. Oh, and Yavo takes a yep. big left, having trouble seeing in that right eye. And that respect is gone, Sean, as he lost that opportunity, as he waited too long. And now, two-time Bellator Bantamweight World Champion, Dudu Eduardo Montes. There were no final questions from you, Red. If you want to touch gloves, do it now. Come out ready to fight. The back of the legs are an option. Picking him up, dragging him down. He was in a similar position with Joe Warren, sent him all the way over the top, Josh Barnett style. Five point throw, beautiful stuff. Looking for it, boom! Uh, like that, yep. right on just like that. Dantes trying to avoid it happening again. And again, the key here is that he's keeping his hands locked. Many guys hit that belly to back suplex, they let the opponent go. You felt that momentum swing of Dantes starting to push him back. Boy, that's great. Oh, oh, he he dropped shot. It. He hurt him. Legitimate knockdown. Great recovery. Yeah, good recovery. Trying to get it back to the feet, and he does. But that shot, that that shot hurt. hurt. Yeah. And now the new Bellator Bantamweight World Champion, Darion Acceptable to be brought down to the mat. Caldwell loves his position. He loves his position. Oh my God, Can he's he going to take it. And it's all over. He has it. Ref, get wait, in wait, there. Wait, get yeah. in there, ref. And it's all over. Darian Caldwell submits Leon Roigo. Pulling over the rules in the back. Protect yourself at all times. Obey my commands at all times. If you wish to touch gloves, do so now. Anything to finish the fight against Horiguchi, he wins the round. Talk about potential adjustments for each fighter as Horiguchi goes to the air with that knee strike. Now the small north side position. Horiguchi looking for the guillotine again, just like in Japan. What, what Darian needs to do right now is control that hand, take his time. The new Bellator Bantamweight champion. Fisherman came fishing in America for the Bellator Bantamweight Championship, and he will return to Japan as not only Ryzen Fighting Federation Bantamweight champ, but he is now also the Bellator MMA 135-pound champion. No final push. Are you ready? You want to touch gloves? Right, Am I ready to fight? Had the walkout knockouts in his career. Three minutes into a potential 25-minute championship fight. Overextended, right into a mistake, and Apache's taking advantage of him. Now he's on the back. It's a fighter to understand, hey, you don't have to win this thing right away. You don't have to win it in the first round. You don't have to win it in the second round. Juan Archuleta is the Bellator Bantamweight World Champion. All have it for the winner by unanimous decision. And now the new Bellator Bantamweight World Champion, SP Sergio Pettis.